Five reasons you are feeling bad now. Have you ever felt so bad to the point of crying, but you can't even point out what might be responsible? Well, the truth is that every one of us goes through such times. Sometimes we feel like a superman who's out to save the world, and other times we feel sad and almost hopeless. Jackie Kennedy, a one-time first lady of the United States during the presidency of John F. Kennedy, said, One must not let oneself be overwhelmed by sadness. The problem, however, is not that we are sad, but not being able to figure it out. And when we don't, we become worried and overwhelmed. To be able to overcome this, however, you need to find out the likely cause of your sadness. In this video, we'll be sharing with you 5 reasons you are feeling bad now. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you won't miss other interesting videos like this. 1. You're hanging around negative people When you surround yourself with negative people who do nothing but complain and lay blames all day long, you'll soon begin to feel a lot of the negative energy around you because, like them, you are not focusing on finding solutions, you are more concerned about the problem than the solution and talking about it won't help you feel good. Instead, it'll take your time and then leave you exhausted at the end of the day, resulting in an unproductive day. How is anyone supposed to feel good that way? Surrounding yourself with negative people who continually talk and think about how bad things are, you begin to reaffirm your negative beliefs. Of course, it's good to talk about things that bother you because it can help you feel better but there is a fine line between therapeutic talk and complaining. According to Robert Thiel, don't let negative and toxic people rent space in your head. Raise the rent and kick them out. Joel Osteen, an American pastor and author, once said, You cannot expect to live a positive life if you hang with negative people. Here's a little bonus. Don't isolate yourself from people because you want to avoid negative people. Instead, surround yourself with positive people who will influence you positively from time to time and lift your mood. 2. You're comparing your life to others, especially those portrayed on social media. Another reason you might be feeling bad now is that you spend time comparing your life with what people portray on social media. Jada DeWalt, a self-taught artist and author said, Don't let others box you into their idea of what they think you should be. A confined identity is a miserable way to exist. Be you and live free. Trust that in living true to yourself, you will attract people that support and love you just as you are. Comparing yourself to others does no good for anyone. Instead, it makes you feel bad and you begin to doubt your abilities. It's especially worse when you spend your time comparing yourself to people we see on social media, a platform that allows people to show only the part of their lives they want you to see. A Facebook research conducted by Happiness Research Institute about how social media habits affect our happiness, half of the participants stopped using Facebook for a week while the other half continued. At the end of the week after the research, it was discovered that Facebook had a direct impact on our happiness level. The half who stayed off Facebook reported a significantly higher degree of satisfaction with their lives and lower levels of sadness and loneliness. This study doesn't only stand true for Facebook alone but other social media apps as well. Too many people spend their entire day flipping through social media in a bid to find out what others are doing with their lives and how you can either match up or beat their standards. They forget that their only competition should be themselves. Betty Jamie Chong said, Comparison with myself brings improvement. Comparison with others brings discontent. 3. You neglect to set goals When you set goals for yourself, it gives you something to hope and look forward to. You know that you wake up every day to work hard to achieve those goals. However, when you are without goals, you live each day accepting whatever comes your way, whether good or sad. At some point, you become bored and get tired of life. It is at that point you start feeling sad for no particular reason. Also, when you don't set goals, you won't learn to improve yourself. You just go in the direction of the wind because you are empty. 4. Giving in to fear Fear is nothing but an imagination in your head. It is not the reality of things. Do you want to know something? Yes, you do. Everyone has one fear or the other. But not everyone feels sad when they think of their fears because they don't give in to it. They realize it's only an image in their head. 
So, rather than worry over something in their head, they face and overcome their fears, and this eventually leaves them feeling great about their abilities. Del Kaneji said, Fear doesn't exist anywhere except in the mind. The ancient sage saying goes like this, Fear itself is a creation of your mind. It does not exist independently. Since it is a fabrication, you don't have to fight it. Just understand it. Understanding is the key to freedom. 5. You don't even understand your needs. Sometimes we think we're not happy because of something, only to find out that after doing all that, we're still unhappy. It's like drinking water to solve your hunger problem, when in real sense, you have to get food. The question now is, how do you find out what the problem or your needs are? Self-awareness. You need to spend time with yourself to find out what you truly want and what makes you truly happy, not what you think will make you happy. Once you can do this, you'll discover what the real problem is. Thank you very much for watching our videos. We'll like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we handpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.